remember what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? The mother of six-year-old Nadia King is considering a lawsuit after an elementary school's child crisis provider invoked the state's Baker Act, placing the girl at a behavioral health center for 48 hours without her mother's consent. Martina Falk, Nadia's mother, says her daughter has ADHD and global developmental delay, a term for children who have taken longer to reach developmental milestones, such as walking or talking. She's awaiting testing for Asperger's syndrome. Her mother says she performs on a three or four year old level and this makes it hard for her to communicate what she experienced while committed for 48 hours at the mental health facility. She'll say, mommy, I don't want another shot. It's very scary because I'm afraid of what happened, her mother said. According to an incident report by the Jacksonville Sheriff's Department, Officers responded to a call from a social worker at Love Grove Elementary School in Jacksonville, Florida on February 4th. A social worker there said that Nadia was a threat to herself and others and had been destroying school property, attacking staff, and was out of control. A statement from the school district, Duval County Public Schools, shared with the local news outlet Action News Jax, says the school officials followed protocol by calling Child Guidance, a crisis care provider, and that it was a mental health counselor from Child Guidance who made the Baker Act decision, not the school officials. The incident report states that Nadia's mother was notified that her daughter was being transported. Falk and her attorney says that Falk was not notified until after the Baker Act had been invoked and was not given a say as to whether or not her daughter should be committed. She says Nadia was taken to River Point Behavior Center, an 82-bed treatment facility that specializes in mental health, substance abuse, and dual diagnosis services. River Point accepts patients of all ages under provisions of the Baker Act. So what the hell is the Baker Act? The Baker Act is a Florida law that allows individuals to be involuntarily institutionalized if the individual is believed to be mentally ill and poses a threat of serious bodily harm to themselves or others, according to the state of Florida Department of Children and Families. Falk waited for several hours at the facility before she had a chance to see her daughter, who she says was sedated. Body camera footage released Thursday by the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office shows Nadia being escorted out of Love Grove and placed in the back seat of a police car on her way to be involuntarily committed. In the footage, Nadia appears to be very calm as a female police officer is holding her hand, escorting her off campus. She actually has been very pleasant, very pleasant. One of the unidentified officers is heard telling the other. It was like they were shocked that the little girl wasn't going crazy. Like, they, I think they really expected some type of belligerent, rude, just out of control little girl. And this girl was very calm the entire time. I don't think a little kid can turn something that, like that off. If she was as unruly as they're saying she was, I don't think that this little kid can just turn it on and off like that. The little girl was like very calm. In fact, one of the officers is heard saying, I think they're pushing the button because this little girl has been very pleasant. Even when I arrived, I didn't see all of this ruckus that they're talking about. You know, this is what happens oftentimes with little black boys and girls. They will, any type of little disruption or disagreement or whatever, they call in the police. They trying to get you a, a, a medical exam. They trying to give you shots. Trying to dope you up. Who knows what they injected in that baby's body. All they got to do is hit you one time and you hook for life.
you're never the same. To the staff at Love Grove Elementary School, Duval County Public Schools, and Child Guidance for sending that little girl through that horrific ordeal. Your mama should be embarrassed and your daddy should have pulled out. No more talk. What the haters talking about? Yeah.